Johnny, a 10-year-old undocumented girl who was escorted out of Driscoll Children's Hospital by Border Patrol agents will be visited by family members tomorrow. It's a story that's making international headlines. Rosa Maria Hernandez is currently being held in an Immigration and Customs Detention Center in San Antonio. This video released by the family's attorney appears to show agents standing outside of Rosa Maria's room at Driscoll Children's Hospital. She was brought here earlier this week and was released on Wednesday. That's when Border Patrol agents took her to that detention center in San Antonio. It is still unclear when she will be released or whether she'll be deported to Mexico. Rosa Rosa Maria's mom tells us she's been in contact with her daughter every day. Meanwhile, the story has captured the hearts of many people and even politicians who are pressuring the government to release her. Meanwhile, we asked Driscoll Children's Hospital officials about their policy when it comes to the supervision of undocumented children being treated there at the hospital. We asked when are agents or representatives of ICE allowed access to the hospital? Do they require prior approval? If so, by who? And what kind of documentation do they need to provide? And finally, how long are they allowed to remain on the premises? The hospital's response in its entirety was Driscoll's priority is to advocate for our patients within the confines of the law.